hi guys so i got my crystal council box so this is i have been so excited to get this box um this was again um uh advertised to me on facebook i guess facebook knows me pretty well um this is what the box looks like let me show you before i open it okay so this is you can get um Okay, anyway, this is what the box looks like. Okay, let me tell you about the box. So this box, you can get different tiers. And the one I got um, is the $25 one. And you get a survey the first of the month asking what kind of crystals you want. And then you could fill out the survey. And oh, I was so excited. I've, I've been getting into crystals lately. So let's see what's inside. Um, uh, I have a scroll. Look at this. This is so cool. I bet this is the cheat sheet. Um, yeah, so I'm gonna look at that later. But, so this is all their social medias, but of course I'll leave them down below. So, oh, okay, cool. So this is five Spitz chocolate tea. It says, we use in highest quality herbs. There is an absolutely no need to include any artificial flavoring. Enjoy your tea the way it's intended. So that's what it looks like. I don't know what kind of tea. I don't want to open it because I think it's loose and then I'll probably spill it all over myself because that's just what I do. And then I think this is a sticker. More stickers from my computer. And then we have a butterfly. Cute. And then it says the Crystal Counselor Newsletter. March th Newsletter. It says, Dear subscriber, as the weather warms and Mother Earth comes back to life, so should your spiritual well-being. Spring into the next few months with a passion. Focus on your emotion and spiritual body as you anticipate the month of growth to come, whether you realize it or not. The weather has powerfully affected on your mind and body if you aren't where you're envisioned yourself to be now is the perfect time to start each day that you wake up you have a chance to make the best of your life the crystal council and the litter events march 28th is a full moon and the zodiac transition is aries on march 21st and then here, oh, this says throat chakra tea. The powerful aquamarine crystals are placed in the herbs for 24 hours during the blending process to infuse their essence and energy. This fifth chakra blend is here to assist those seeking healing and balance issues dealing with communication, creative self expression. It's definitely what I need. Um, is this the plantable intention flower card? Place your intention into the hundred. I guess this is what that is. Buy a degree of a card and watch as wildflowers grow before your very eyes. Each day, make a point to tend to these flowers as well as you and your own needs. Let them be a reminder to stop love and give yourself love. Anyway, that's so now this is what we have. Um, this is a bag. I don't know. So, this is a Lapidorite. So, this is what it looks like. Very cool. I'm gonna put the sticker on it. Okay, Lapidorite. I'll read about it later. And then this one is, um, Galenite, Galen, it's, I don't know why I can't read it, Galen, uh, Bubble Wrap, I'm having trouble finding the opening, oh. Oh my god, 
look. It's beautiful. Wow. I love it. There, I put the sticker. Anyway, we don't just worry about that. And then we just have two more crystals. I don't know what these are. I'm guessing this might be obsidian. But I am not sure, so let's look at this. Okay, it says, this is it. It's pretty long, so let me look at what, um, okay, let me look. Okay, so this is Black Onyx. It's known as one of the most strongest protection stone, and its main power is defense and absorption of negative energies. This stone acts as a shield to protect from one hostile energies in, with a, in a workspace, home, or uncomfortable environment. Honest raise one's confidence levels and make them feel more safe and secure in any situation, while also pushing you to try in different activities. That's good. I need that. Um, and then this is Dermorite, which I think I got in that Pisces box. Let's see right here. Dermorite, um, is highly with the third eye and helps Activate one's psychic abilities. The abilities can range from simple actions, such as remembering one's dreams better, to lucid dreaming, astral projection, and connecting with higher realms, synchronizing channels, and even forms ESP. I highly recommend this stone for anyone who is a student or learning field, as Dharma Tite helps one retain information, expand our mental capacity to raise one's intuition. That's pretty cool. So, like, vibrations. The paper keeps. Oh. Um. Where's the other stone? Hold on. Oh, um. This is Galleonite. It says. It says. Galleonite's heavy weight gives you gives a powerful grounding ability that activates and opens the root chakra. This stone root this stone roots you and your vibrations down to earth and harnesses the personal power that exists within. Gallion will teach you how to stay motivated and increase your drive and focus and determination and access whatever you desire. Okay. And then finally, a lapidorite, which is a stone of magic and protection, allowing one access to deep within where an abundance of knowledge can be discovered. Lapidorite invites us to be more adventurous and going when normally, when normally wouldn't. It allows our desire and energies to roam free while offering a protective bubble that will aid in the most purest transformation. That's pretty cool. I like this. I'm so, I like it. I like how we get, oh, this, I'm so, you guys, I bet this is this, uh, this might be the reusable um, sticker. Um, so this is the scroll. This is what it says for March. And then it says this. I really like this.
So let me know what you guys think if I should continue with this box, which I think I definitely will. Um, I love it a lot. I think it's amazing. So let me know. Thank you. Bye. Hey guys. So I just got my Crystal Council box for April. I will probably put my first one for March combined with this one because that makes more sense i have to find the opening so i have the 25 dollar apprentice tier which is that you customize your own box I got like five to six crystals i think so yeah here we go okay so here's the box right here um Okay, the April newsletter, so I'll hold that up. It says, Dear subscriber, thoughts are a powerful thing more than ever we can understand. We shape our reality every day by feeling and, and thoughts we carry with us. The energy released by these thoughts can control every aspect of our lives, from interactions with our friends and families to the outcome of our goals. Each day, we are given a clean slate to start fresh with new and loving thoughts and ideas. Take advantage of your life and create reality. You want to start living with tomorrow today. So, the lunar events, April 26th is the full pink moon. And it's uh, April 20th is starting Taurus season. So, and next, I see this says fueled by happy thoughts i guess it's a sticker i have to figure out i do have a whole bunch of stickers on my computer but i am running out of room so i have to figure out a new place to put them okay so next we have this it says the buffalo as a spirit and animal symbolizes abundance and brings strength, stability, and gratitude. It's significant. It signifies as time in your life to explore whether you surround what surrounds you and test your boundaries. A buffalo as a totem animal aligns with earth centering and selfish soul. And a selfless soul helps contain connect with one mother earth. So that's cool, a little miss. And then this is the scroll that tells us what is everything. And now let's go to the crystal. Start with this one. First in this. Bubble wrap, bubble wrap. I'm trying to debate if I need my scissors. I probably do. I did say... I wanted rare crystals, but let's see what happens. Oh, so this is an ox. I don't know what kind of crystal, but we'll see in the guide. Oh, okay, so we have two crystals in here. Oh, looks like this. Here's the first one. Here's the second one. And then we have this, which is Argonite. I'm gonna try to save the labels, but that probably won't work because they probably lose the stick after they're gone. Bubble wrap. This is what it looks like. An argonite heart. There we go. See, I do it like this. And then we have a bagged agite. So let's see. what it looks like. Oh, 
Okay, now let's look at the guide. Shall we? The scroll. Okay. It says, and I, this is the scroll with all the stuff on it. It says, hi, and I put just a random username. April is upon us when most people think of April, they think of rain. The dreariness of rain, rains can affect all of us. But through the rain that brings us flowers, the warmer weather, and most of all life. Watching Mother Earth awaken from her winter slumber is an amazing sight to see. The changing of the seasons is a long process. It's not just a snap of the fingers. Use the stones in your box. They give all your power and energy you need to make the necessary changes while at the same time enjoying the growth process. This month we crept your box around stressfully transformation, calming patience and dreams. Yeah, so that's what I chose. So let me get so organize can be focus found in every color with and will help I'm trying to hold this and read that the scroll is relying on all chakras this stone offers emotional stability by balancing the heart with the mind look at the stone in times of difficult situations to offer relief and meditate with the stone while scanning your body of all of its chakras to increase its Effectiveness. Carrying this piece daily has been known to bring inner balance and expand one's awareness of themselves and their current environment. Argonite strengthens our minds and will help focus your daily emotions on things that are more important to you. That's what I need. It's cute. I like it. <sighs> Next, we got... Um, oh, Boss Swan Agate. Oh, okay, so it's called the, so this is the Banded Agate. The Ag, Agate, Agate. I don't know why I can't say it. It's beautiful, look. It's known as, it's the rarest and highest, Vibration stone of on of all the agates. The stone is found very close. It's very close off in the district of Botswana. And it's hard to acquire in large quantities. This supreme agate helps assist in connecting with one conscious to their higher selves. While meditating with the stone, one will notice gently push forward towards their life path. As almost if it's helping if it's a helping hand, after meditating with the stone, make sure you cleanse it. And try to carry it with you each day. Let this bonsai aggregate serve as a daily reminder of the constant change one goes through during a transformation of period of their life. Allow the stone to jumpstart you on a new fresh path with endless opportunities and new beginnings. Very nice. And next we have how light. Oh, which I think is... I think this is the white stone. I'm pretty sure. Mm, I'm 90% sure this is how light. How light will come and soothe emotions that may be in the slightest bit overwhelming. The stone will work to help reduce stress and anger that usually leads to anxiety and depression. It pushes pushes us to making rational decisions where our emotions may overcome us. Okay. Uh, next. Where's the bag? The bag. No, this isn't.
And then we have this one, which I believe is Mystic Marnadite. I believe. So this one. And it's a magical stone that helps realign the entire chakra system. The stone helps one develop their own intuitive and psychic abilities as well as providing clarity of the mind. Mer Stick more light helps in dream recall and the, vis the vividness of them. We recommend placing this on your third eye during meditation. Doing so will help, help in unlocking and strengthening of this chakra. Oh, that's cute. And then at the end they have personal growth is a process that isn't always pretty. There will be rainy days where you feel both defeated and lack in any drive. But remember with with rain comes flowers, with hard times comes good times. Enjoy where you are because you look back on your growth. It's a beautiful sight to see. Oh, that's very sweet. Let me see if I could find the stone that this guy is. Um, I don't know if it necessarily matters about the stone, but look how freaking cute. So that is the April box. Let me know if you guys are enjoying these boxes or if you want me to try another box. Um, thank you for watching. I will see you guys soon. Don't forget to subscribe. Bye! Hey guys, so I got another box from the Crystal Council, even though I did get a box the other day. So, I don't know if this was a typo or something, but let's see. Uh, it looks like the same April newsletter fueled by happy thoughts. The buffalo thing. Um, so we got carnelian, which we didn't get last time. I'm kind of confused why I got two, but look, it looks really cool. Carnelian. And then Then we have the ox again. Yeah, it's, well, it's different than the one I got the other day, so. It's a buffalo, not an ox. Then we got lazulite. I feel like I got this stone before. And then we have... These two stones. So let's look at the... The scroll and see what's the deal. Is it going to open? Oh, I ripped it. I ripped it. It looks like...
Okay, so most people think of rain, but Uranus that rain can affect us all, but it's the rain that brings us the flowers. Yeah. To give you all the power and energy, you need to make the necessary changes. Also. At the same time, enjoying the growth of process. This month, we've crafted your box around love, relationship, intuition, and strength and power. Oh, okay. Bronzite. Um, I guess this could be bronzite, I guess. I don't know. Maybe. If you guys know, let me know. Bronzite is known as the son of Courtesy due to its energy promoting love, compassion, equality, and joy. This stone helps you stay focused on what's most important. Your grant coat and grants you the courage to let your heart leave whatever decision you desire. So next we have Lazulite. Lazulite enumerates power vibrations that directly resonate with one's third eye and helps activate their unique psychic ability along with attuning to our energies, higher dimension, and realms. One will also gain insight into their dreams. We will be able to understand the meaning of purpose of images and their emotions we see and feel in this realm. Lazulite helps one disconnect from the physical realm and pushes pushes one and to have an out of body experience during deep sleep cycles or strong meditation se sessions. Don't confuse the stone with the mineral lazar lazarite. Lazarite is the main mineral found in lapis lazuli, not lazulite. Both minerals are entirely different from another. So. And next we have. Hermatite, I guess it's this one. Hermatite, much like its appearance, Hermatite has very similar, yeah, effects of a magnet. It attracts and pulls down positive energy and opportunities for your benefit. This also is a grounding stone which helps us align and focus on physicality which is in front of us. Not where our head tends to drift to. Hermatite is the one of the most powerful stones when it comes to keeping you focused on the task at hand. Alright. And then... Oh, it fell out of the bag. Carnelian. Carnelian is a mineral within quartz family, and just by looking at it, you can tell it's fueled with power and vitality. It simulates the lower three chakras and ignites confidence, passion, and courage over things that are most important to you. Carnelian's motto would be, if there is a will, there is a way. One suggestion is to use a powerful grasp the stone has in your hand each morning and night and repeat it to repeat to the universe and yourself what exactly you would like and nothing can stop you and then the edges the bottom is the same as i got yesterday so i don't it's cool i'm glad it, i'm not complaining that i got another box i'm just kind of confused because i got one yesterday so, I don't know what's going on, but hope you guys enjoyed that video. I will see you later. Bye!